Hello there, I am Giant Girl with more Earthbound. In the last part, we got here to Deep Darkness. It's very deep because the water is very deep and it hurts you the deep if you go into the deeper parts of the water. So, slowly like the tax at your health and everything, it's just not good. And then, um, it's, it's dark because you have to actually use a Hawkeye to light up some of the place so you can move around. Because you can only move around in the darkness up to a certain point, so that's what they made, that's how they made. That's what they do with this part of the um, game, with like having to use the Hawkeye. It's like you, you have to use it, basically. So I'm gonna just try to find my way around. I think we're gonna take on a upgraded boss. So uh, that's all I'm gonna say for now. But um, I'm trying to find my way over to where it is. Yeah, this isn't helping. Yeah. Oh man, I just I don't really. I think I have to go through a slim path, but I can't really remember where that was. So I'm gonna have to like. I kind of just explore around because I honestly don't know like what a big exact route to take. Let me see here. There's um okay there we go cool. That, that box looks familiar. Where I have to go? Cool. So I'm gonna go down here. It will move so slow in the deep deep water too. And as you see, everyone's HP is decreasing. Paul needs some. Paul needs something. Uh, health. Yeah. I'll give her the beef jerky when she's at lower health. Oh, there it is. Here's the boss I was talking about. Yeah. Okay. So, um. Let's see here. Goods. Let's give the rock candy to Ness, I guess. <laughs> that rhymed. Uh, speed one by one. Cool. Okay. And then what else? Um. Hmm. Horn of Life. Bag of Dragon Knight. Um, I should just be able to give the beef jerky to Paula then, which should be good. Use on Paula. Alright, true maxed out, awesome. Okay, and then we're gonna take on this boss right here. So let's talk to him, he's kind of blocking the way, so let's just talk to him. Okay, you may have forgotten, but burp. <laughs> I can't make a belching noise, sorry. <laughs> on command, I'm not good, I like that. I don't really burp that loud usually anyway. <laughs> I'm the turn of Belch. Uh, I fought, I fought you before. P.U. Don't remember my, you don't you remember my ripe odor? Belch has trained more and has returned much stronger. Burp. Belch has also changed his name to Puke. Barf, vomit, barf, barf. Chuck, chuck. Down to, drown to death and puke. Don't you think that's an incredibly masculine taunt for to throw at you. Sure, why not? So it's much harder this time, but honestly, if we can get a couple good attacks off him, we should be good. So let's see, PSI, um, yeah, PSI Rock and Gamma. Um, just gonna try PSI Rock and Beta then. Paula can use PSI Freeze um, Omega. Just because she has the PP for that. And then Jeff can use a multi bottle rocket. So let's just do that. Yeah. Fire the multi bottle rocket. And he fired it. Boom. It did 1873 HP worth of damage, I believe that's what it was. 1800 something. 73, yeah, that's my guess. Oh, you, oh yeah, Pooh came out from the clouds. Pooh used his new power, PK Starstorm. Pooh tried PK Starstorm Alpha. Or PSI Starstorm Alpha. And he was defeated. Wow. And we have Pooh back in our party now, awesome. And that's the friends gain 31,264 experience each. So then we left the present, inside the present was a Casey's bat. Ness took it. Pause in the level 51, offense went up by 2, defense went up by 1, speed went up by 1, guts went up by 1, vitality went up by 1, maximum HP went up by 3, max PP went up by 1. She always the power, Paul, we always the power of PSI, shield, beta. Jeff was in level 49, max HP went up to 2, Pooh's level was in level 46, uh, old baby offense went up by 3, speed went up by 1, max HP went up by 2, max and PP went up by 2, Pooh provides the life, the power of life up gamma. Okay, so now he can revive people and have a chance, or have a chance to revive people, just using by, just using that, for, in, using PP, I guess. But, so we don't have to use like a cup of life noodles or a, um, or a horn of life or anything like that. I'm just gonna go over here. So yeah, the case is bad. I really don't recommend you equip that right now because it misses like 75% of the time. And that's not good. So you don't wanna, like, um, you know, do that yet. Unless you feel really lucky on like back attacks. But for me, I'm just gonna stick to my, um, 
my minor league bat, I think it is. Oh, big league bat. There we go. Big league bat. So yeah, now with Pooh with us, we can explore a lot more, pe a lot more stuff. So yeah, the brainstone, couple life noodles, and bracer of kings. Just like we left, with, just like what he had before, before he left in the desert to go run out the piece I star storm. So that's good. Oh, you move so slowly in this water. Okay, I'm gonna go over here. Hopefully, this is why, you know, the right way I'm supposed to go. I'm hoping it is. Okay, here it is. Nice. No enemies around us. Cool. Haha. <laughs> Let's go in. This is the end of deep darkness, by the way. Let's talk to some of these guys. Um, wish I. <laughs> I he didn't say um. My bad. Wish I. <laughs> Okay, and basically all they're saying is we're shy so far. So what will this one say? We're shy. I think if you talk to this one, he'll actually have a different dialogue. We're all shy. Rumor I heard. Rumor I heard a book to fix shyness. That there is where I don't know. Just a rumor. Okay. So yeah. So yeah, we got a trash can here. Let's dig around in the trash can. Well, let's see here. There's a death ray inside. Yeah, let's give that to Paul. let's give that to Jeff. I almost said Paul. Let's give that to Jeff because he could use it. Um, let's see. Is, it, oh, is Jeff's inventory full though? No, let's see. It's one more space. Cool. Let's go back to Ness's inventory then. Let's give the death ray to Jeff then. Okay, and then let's uh let's read his description first before we equip it. So here's the death ray right here. Uh, help. Yeah, death ray. Uh, Jeff can equip this weapon. That's all it's okay. That's all it says. Okay, if I don't equip it, then it's in Jeff's hyper beam. Okay, so his offense right now is 108, but with the death ray, it goes up to 140. So that's like 32 more, a boost of 32 offense. So it's definitely equipped to that. So now his offense is 140, and his defense is 176. There we go. Now, let's see here. We should be good other than that. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Let's see, this is a can, I guess, no problem here. It's just a can, or is it something? Yeah, it's just not a problem here. No problem here. Here's a mailbox, here's a telephone. We might as well end the part right here, because there's a telephone and everything. So yeah, so this has been the end of my Earthbound Let's Play part, and next part will take on um, more of this area, where there's a bunch of shy enemies and whatnot. So yeah, this has been Draco again. I would like to thank you for watching again. Goodbye, and hope to see you guys in the next part of my Earthbound Let's Play.